Is this what is this? no idea, but I love it. Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hello, my name's Lily. Go ahead and like and subscribe. Now I haven't got a microphone. I normally use a microphone um when I'm recording, but I think it's broken. So I don't want to use it and then have all the sound messed up and then have to film again because I'm not I'm not doing that. So in today's video, we're unboxing this month's witch casket. It is the December witch casket. I'm again late uploading this. I do apologize, um, but it did arrive a bit late and I have been procrastinating as always. But yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. It's a monthly witch subscription box. It's £26 a month, I believe. They do ship worldwide. I will put a link in the description if you are interested. But yeah, let's get right into it. I've been getting witch casket for a few months now. So if you are interested in previous boxes, they will be over on my channel. Go check them out. So this is the box. It's always... Ooh. <laughs> right? So this is the box, it's always the same style. Really cute boxes, you can keep them, they're great for storage. Decent thick cardboard as well, all recyclable packaging, which we love. Now, it always comes with a little booklet that tells you like the theme of that box and all the stuff that's in here. Straight away, I don't know how I feel about these colors. It's giving me like, like 90s Avril Lavigne vibes. Does that make sense? <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. But yeah, this is Candle Magic. For December, we've got candle magic, and everything in here is going to be red and black. Everything's always very cohesive, same colour scheme, matches everything, so everything in here is going to be red and black because the booklet is red and black, which is cute. So we have the inside of the booklet, it tells you what everything is. So let us please start by saying a huge thank you for all your birthday wishes last month. They were four years old last month. Um, in those four years, our wonderful casket crew of witches has grown so much and we now have delivered our magical subscription boxes to over 60 countries. We are so proud and grateful to you, our family of wonderful witches. Thank you. December's theme is candle magic and we hope you will all find the contents and information contained within the, this month's casket useful as you practice your craft. So I'll go through this as I go through everything else. This month it did come in like a bigger box because we had this in, which is our first item. Now this doesn't fit in the box. So it came in like a bigger box with the casket and then this was inside the box. So again, this is the same pattern packaging as, you know, the booklet. So this is a cauldron oil burner. This is a witch casket essential. Now I already have one of these, but I'll show you what it is. How cute is this? So it's even got handles. So it's a little cauldron and you put your tea light in there and then you can put your essential oils and water or a wax melt on the top. I have one currently that I use for essential oils. So I think I'll probably have this as my wax melt burner because I have so many wax melts that I just don't use. So allow the magical properties of essential oils and wax melts to sweep through your sacred space. An excellent aid to spell work and meditation. Um, yeah, it's just really cute. So really great for wax melts, essential oils and all that. Um, like I said, I've got so many wax melts that I just don't use. So this is great to have two, one for essential oils, one for wax melts. So next up, we always get an art print. I really love these. Um, they're all on my wall. I think they're just all so beautiful the way they look. This is absolutely stunning. This is this month's art print. So this is brought to you by a new artist to Witch Casket. We're so happy to share their amazing work with you. So Connor James Art, I will put their Instagram name on the screen. I'll put a link down below and there's a website. So I'll put a link to their website down below. Now this, this is beautiful. So you've got a pair of hands holding a candle that is lit and the wax is melting down the hands. Yeah, I've always been really drawn to like fire and I am obsessed with candles. So I absolutely love that. The colors and everything, it just looks so pretty. Um, yeah, I do want to get everything. I say this every video. I want to get everything framed. Um, yeah, we'll get around to that. But that's a really cute art print. It's on really nice thick cards. So you can put these in collages. You can put them in your book um, or a book, scrapbook. You can put them on your wall, frame them, whatever you want to do. And the next up, we have this little pouch. Again, the sticker, the same colour scheme. This is a positive energy candle ritual. So this is a Witch Casket exclusive, which means it's only available from Witch Casket. 
So it contains everything you need to attract positive energy and joy. Wow, okay, cute. So we have a white spell candle. So we've got a big stick candle, which is for power. We have mint. Ooh, we've got a bag of mint. Now these always come in biodegradable bags. Oh, oh that smells, that smells so nice. So it's a bag of mint. Oh, that's really, that's amazing. So we've got a bag of mint for energy. And then we have a marjoram, another herb, which is for joy, which feels so soft. Amazing. And then we have a candle holder. Oh, this is amazing. I've actually got one of these. It's like a little pentacle holder and I never really have any stick holders. So you pop that in there. That's so cute. So because spell candles can vary slightly in thickness, um, if your particular spell candle feels in any way loose, please melt some wax in the bottom of the holder to hold the candle in place. Yeah, so I'd have to do that with that because that's a bit wobbly. Melt some wax there, pop it in just to keep it in place. Okay, and then it comes with instructions and on the back we have like a tarot card of the High Priestess, which is just a really cool design. So um, you'll need everything. So you put the candle in the holder, you circle it with the mint and the marjoram, um, set your intention to feel happier, more energised, light the candle, meditate on the flame, relax. Yeah, it basically tells you exactly what you have to do. You must extinguish the flame, do not blow it out or the energy of your spell could be lost snuff it out that's why you don't blow out candles i use the lid of the candle to snuff the candle out um i do need to get me a candle snuffer do you know those fancy things that you like put on the candle and it snuffs it out with the handle oh i love pouches because i have so much stuff um so i always need the extra space so this is a cotton pouch this is a witch casket exclusive. It is a black cotton pouch. So how could this enchanting pouch best serve your desires? Perhaps it could encase your candles, tarot or oracle cards, crystals or curiosities. Its list of uses is limited only by your imagination. But I do really like these because um, I like to have certain place, places, places to store my stuff because I feel like everything overflows. But I like these because then you can tie it and you can just hang it somewhere, like hang it on a door or just hang it somewhere and it's out of the way, a hook on the wall, so you don't have to worry about storage. And it's got this really cool design on the front. I can't tell you what it is because I'm not too sure. Maybe like a candle, there's a pentacle on it. It looks kind of like a castle at the same time. No idea, but I love it. We always get a loose leaf tea, which I love. I love my fruit teas. So this is a Christmas blend loose leaf tea. So enjoy a witch's brew created especially for Christmas, Yule. Um, luxury ingredients, so it's black tea, vegan candy, okay, cinnamon clove, jasmine petals. Um, it's got a high antioxidant level and a medium caffeine content. So its properties are cinnamon is for luck, abundance and love. Cloves are for love and protection. And jasmine is for divination, love and sensuality. Oh wow, this actually has like bits of, oh my god, this, can you, see? oh my god, this smells like Christmas, I'm so excited, I love, Christmas is one of my favourite times of the year and I love Christmas scented, flavoured, all sorts of stuff. Can you see, it's got little, um, look, it's got little green and red Christmas trees in, that's amazing, again comes in a biodegradable bag, it just smells so good and Christmassy. I'm so excited to try that. And then again, we always get an enamel pin. I am collecting all of my enamel pins up there. They are always beautiful. So pretty. This pin is beautiful. It says Hocus Pocus. Um, absolutely love this. I love to collect pins. So they're great if you wear them on your clothes. You can put them on bags, hats, accessories, or you can just keep them. You can frame pins. They're amazing. So this is a witch casket exclusive. So we witches love a bit of hocus pocus. Now you can flaunt it with our exclusive enamel pin. So yeah, look how cute that is. So it's just written in black and white. It's got little stars and two little red flames at the end of the words. And that's the back of it. It's got a cute little three um, set of candles on the back of the card, just as the illustration. But yeah, that's so cute. I love that everything's so cohesive and the amount of different things. I've got some beautiful pins from them. They're always really good quality as well. Like, yeah, they feel really good. Oh, 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 cute. Okay, 
So next we have a tea light candle set. This is a witch casket essential. So it comes in this little black pouch. So use these candles in simple rituals and meditation to purify and protect. White purifies, brings peace and makes way for new beginnings. Black is for protection, removing hexes and banishing negative energies. Um, bit simple, but I do like candles. And if you are a very spell based witch or even meditating and all that, um, I haven't meditated in a while, but I probably should. So these are actually very good to just light them, obviously, because what they are, white can attract and black can um, kind of banish. So, yeah, I think, I feel like I kind of wish it would have been with something a little bit extra, maybe another little spell thing. But I don't know if that's me just being, I don't know, I do like tea lights because I feel like tea lights can be expensive. So it is nice when you get them because I know I'm going to want to buy more and stock up. I don't think I've ever had a black tea light candle. I've got the black tall stick candles. But I don't think I have a black tea light candle, so that's actually quite cool. And then it comes with a little card and it tells you on the back what the white one does and what the black one does. So you can have that with it at all times. You don't always have to keep the little book with you. You can just have it on the card. And it comes with a cute pouch. So I love that. Is this what is th Right, I am psychic. Um this is what I was talking about earlier. This is a candle snuffer. This is the fancy thing that I was like. What is, okay. Um, this is a witch casket essential. This is, <laughs> this is like good quality. This is thick, like, I don't know what this is made of. So be sure not to blow away your spell's energy by ensuring all spell candles are either burned out or snuffed out. Um, yeah, and then on it, it just has a little tag that says that. This is so cool. I've wanted to snuff at one of these for ages. And I like the fact how long it is. So if you've got a candle that's low or something, you can just snuff it out. <gasps> Why am I so excited at that? That has really excited me. Especially because I said it literally five minutes ago that I was going to get me one of these. Um, I do need to get me a candle snuffer. Do you know those fancy things that you like put on the candle and it snuffs it out with the handle? Amazing. Love. That's... And it makes sense because it's a candle, it's like a candle magic box, isn't it? Yes, we always get a crystal as well. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, this is a selenite um, crystal. Oh, it comes in a little pouch. This is a selenite tumbled stone and it comes with an information card. So selenite is a stone of peace and harmony, a beautiful cleansing stone which can calm your mind and lift your spirits. It's a great stone for meditation. It's like cut like a square. Um... I have a selenite wand and it's so cool. So it's like twisty and it's got a point. So it's like a nice selenite wand. Um, and I just think it's really cool. So this looks like it's kind of cut from a wand or a, a big piece of selenite. So a big piece of selenite, yeah. So this is really cool. I do look, I have so many crystals, tumbled stones. My goodness, I could start my own museum with them. So this is amazing. I don't think I have a selenite stone i've got my selenite wand but i don't think i have that i don't think i have it like this size so that's really great especially because it's great for meditation i do like to hold um crystals when i meditate kind of get the energies going a bit more i do think it adds a bit of something else so that's a really great stone to have in there i really like that oh is this a coaster this is a witch casket exclusive um it's a slate pentacle Oh, it's a pentacle candle, slate altar tile. Okay, so slate helps you to become grounded and achieve a sense of calmness and balance. This exclusive slate tile can be used as a ritual candle slate or as a decorative altar tile to represent the elements on your altar. So you put your, I thought it was a coaster because that's the bottom. The bottom's nice and soft, so you can put it on any surface. It's not going to ruin it. And then you've got this, um, really nice quality as well this looks like it's like painted on you've got a pentacle you probably could use it as a coaster to be honest I think that'd be a really cool coaster um but I like that to have like in the center if you're doing a ritual put your candle on it I feel like it just adds a bit of something else doesn't it and then you've got all the elements as well I really like that this I think is a wax melt because we had a pentacle wax melt in another box and it had this exact same packaging so it's like black tissue paper with this beautiful 
um, sticker on, which is a cauldron with crystals in. So yeah, I think this is a lemongrass tri 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 triquetra wax melt. I do not know how to pronounce that. This is by the brand Urban Loon. Oh, I know what it is. This is beaut. This looks like white chocolate. This is a beautiful, um, beautiful wax melt. I love these. I don't want to. I don't want to use them because they're so pretty. The Pentacle one was absolutely gorgeous. It was black wax melt, and it was beautiful. So, made from pure soy wax and one hundred percent pure lemongrass essential oil. Lovingly handmade by witches for witches. Lemongrass is for purification, divination, and concentration. It's by Urban Loon on Instagram. I'll put it on the screen and I'll put a link to them down below as well. It smells like when you walk into Lush and I absolutely love that. Oh, it just smells so nice. Oh my God, and I can use that in my new little cauldron oil burner. My little cold, yeah, perfect. Oh, that's so exciting. I love to see everything's together. Like you can use everything together, which I really think is really cool. Really, really, how many times can I say really? Right, the whole candles, the candle snuffer and everything. What else? We always have a parchment scroll, which we do. So this is preparing your candle for magic. This is a witch casket exclusive. We always get scrolls. And I'm finally, I finally got two of them framed. They're gonna go on my wall. Um, very excited about that. So there are many ways to prepare your candles for magic. It can be as simple as selecting the appropriate colour and setting your intentions. This parchment scroll speaks of ways you can add even more potency to your magic. The information can be copied to your grimoire, book of spells, or you can simply place the sheet inside your spell book or frame it and it can add splendour to the walls of your home. Oh, okay. This is a bit basic compared to the other ones that we've had. So this is what it looks like. It's still very pretty. So preparing your candle for magic. So setting intentions, choosing a candle colour. And it gives you loads of colours and tells you what they're um, what they're all for, which is really cool. Inscribing your candles as well, anointing oil on them, dressing in herbs or crystal chips. And then it's got loads of herbs at the bottom telling you how you can use those. So, okay, cute. I'm not a fan of, I, I don't know, I'm not liking the stars. It is giving me a bit of a 90s Avril Lavigne vibe, which there's nothing wrong with because, you know, she's queen and we love her. But... Yeah, I think, let me show you, this was another month's scroll. And I just think this looks just so pretty and like decadent, you know? Um, yeah, I love this style. And the previous ones always seem to have a border. Like, they're kind of simple, but they're not at the same time. I feel like this, is, I don't think we ever had a white one. I think they've always been off-white. So I think this is the first white one. I don't know, maybe not a fan of the paper it's printed on, but I think I'm nitpicking now because there's not actually anything wrong with it. It's just my personal preference that I don't think this is the most pretty looking scroll that I've ever received, but I love what's on there because I have always wondered about the candles. Um, like I know some of them and then the herbs as well, but to have this on here, but to have this on here so I can write it all down in like my grimoire and that. It's really nice, so I do really like that, that it's very informative and you always get a lot of information. Okay, we have one more thing, which is kind of a little extra. Yeah, we have one more thing. So this is vegan treats for the holidays. It's witch, witch casket crescent moon candy. So it looks like candy cane with little crescent moons on. Amazing. So it's just a chocolate mint candy. So there's four little candies in here. Cute, okay, we did get a vegan chocolate bar in one of the other boxes as well, and that chocolate was like really good. I'm not vegan, but I appreciate that they do vegan options because then everybody, pretty much everybody can can have it, which I really appreciate. So yeah, we got some cute vegan candy here. That is the December box. I really like the theme. I like the candle magic. I love, love candles. I love that everything is to do with candles, burning, all that stuff and then you've got the wax melt the burner you know the little the snuffer that is so exciting like i've never been so excited to snuff out candles <laughs> the tea the tea smells amazing it's an amazing box um this i love wax melts having these in here and especially now i've got the burner to use them with and the, the tea lights and everything and there's things in here that i wouldn't think to buy myself 
like that snuffer is different. The tea, the spell, this, like, I'm calling it a coaster. We love, you know, and the art cards, the art cards are so beautiful every single month. I really, really love them. I will put a link to everything down below if you want to buy it, if you want to check out the print. Um, anything else I said I put a link to, I'll try to make sure I put a link to it in the description box. But that is everything for today's video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I think this is going to be my last video of 2020. So hopefully it's been a good one. Um, we, we ended on a good one. This was a really good December Christmas box go. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the little notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a video. Um, my first video of next year, I think, should be me showing you guys how to do a mood board. And then I have a huge pretty little thing haul coming as well next year. I've spent so much money. Um, yeah, so that'll be fun. <laughs> so thanks again so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, evening, whatever you guys are doing. And I will see you guys on my next one. Bye.